Hey there everybody, I was actually working on another video that was going to go live tomorrow. <laughs> but now I don't know because I don't like to run too many videos close to close because if you if you publish so much on YouTube in a 24 hour period they stop notifying people. So I don't know, if, I don't know when that's going to go live, but <laughs> there's a new Fadecast podcast coming out tomorrow so if you want to check that out, uh, link is always in the description. Um, my units that should be demoted from book one video will come out probably tomorrow at evening, maybe. I don't know. Maybe tomorrow. Tuesday. Who knows. Anyway, we have a new banner. <laughs> I am, uh, nervous. I'm nervous. I don't know how this is going to shake out. But I'm nervous. So I guess let's just see what it is. Probably help if I had the volume on. There we go. Oh, man. Okay. What? 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 You've never seen someone with ears like mine? Right off! What? No! I don't have the orbs for this! Oh no. Wow. People are gonna be very happy about Leif. Your kind Which... are the Bayork. Mine the Lagoos. Leif did really well in Choose Your Legends, man. So I don't know. One of the top contenders for the redo banner is uh Wrath of the Beast Tribe. Oh man. Oh, what's the event accompanying this? That's a cat. Can't be Tempest Trial, right? I'll check. I'll check the notifications in a second. We got Mordecai. Yo, my boy. I was always a fan of Mordecai. He's a cool guy. I'm a fan. I didn't get. <laughs> I didn't get any of the beast units from the Fates banner. King of Galia and the Beast Trial. A colorless beast. Okay. Alright. I mean, we had Lean, uh, or, uh, Leanne, obviously, but. Still boils. Oh my gosh. Okay. Who we got? I'm, I'm scanning. I don't see anybody. Okay. I didn't, I didn't see anybody pop up. For what that's worth. Uh, we're gonna go back and look at the the skills real quick. Let me check notifications. Let me check notifications. Grand Hero Battle featuring Har. What? What? I don't know how to process this. I don't know how to process this. I don't know how to process this. Har, dude, Har was another Choose Your Legends contender. What? What? I don't know how to feel right now. I'm so... I'm shook. <laughs> I'm shook. I use that word three times a year. I got two left. Oh, man. Dude, Har is who I wanted and he's free. I'm so happy right now. Um. Wow, okay. So... Here, wow, we're getting a lot of radiant units, man. Like, whoa, <laughs> whoa, we are getting a lot of radiant units. We started off the year with radiant. We just had Yoon. Whew, I'm shook. Okay, compose myself, real quick. Um, let's go, let's go back, and look here. So we have Ranolf. Who is a uh, cat green calf beast unit, and then we have uh, covert cat fang grants defense plus three if unit is within two spaces of an ally grants attack defense three to unit and allies within two spaces of unit during combat. Say no. Uh, Star turns not adjacent. Blah blah blah. That's how you revert. Bloody bloody. Uh, if unit transform grants attack plus two, if unit initiates combat, 
inflicts attack defense minus four on foe during combat, and foe cannot make a follow-up attack. Wow, that's really good. That's pretty good. That's pretty good, man. We got chill attack, dual rally plus for attack and defense, and ward beasts. <sighs> Lathe. I'm trying not to make this video too long because I like have to get up in five hours for work. Uh, Lathe, you are a red cav beast unit. Um, Brazen Cat Fang grants speed plus three. If unit is not adjacent to an ally, grants attack speed plus six during combat. Wow. Uh, that's how we transform. If we transform, we get attack plus two. If unit initiates combat, inflicts attack defense minus four on foe during combat, and foe can't make a follow-up attack. Wow. Okay. And she's got speed defense solo. So not only does her weapon have kind of like a solo uh, attack speed solo kind of built into it, um, it also, you know, she, she's got it in speed defense. So she's getting like plus six, plus 12 speed. If she's not adjacent to anybody, and she transforms, plus her weapon gives her plus... Good God, dude. So she's hitting plus 15 speed, just like off the bat, if she's not adjacent to anybody. Wow. Leith is really good. <laughs> That's, I don't know what her speed is going to be, but I can guarantee you she will double like literally everything. Um, she's got Home Beast, which isn't new, but Speed Defense Solo is... So that's interesting. Oh, my boy Mordecai over here. So he is an infantry blue beast. We got some lagoos popping up here. Uh, he's got beast experience. That's kind of nice. Um, attack defense link three, smite. And then he's got saber tooth fang, which grants defense plus three. If a movement assist skill like reposition, shove, pivot, is used, inflicts attack speed, defense, res, minus four on foe within two spaces of unit and target throughout their next actions after movement. Blah -de blah transform, yada yada yada. If unit transforms, grants attack plus two and deals plus ten damage on special triggers. Well, that's fun. Um, Mordecai, I feel like... I feel like the Ranulf and Lathe kind of have the advantage with like the null follow-up type situation they got going on. Um, but this isn't bad either. This is pretty solid too. That's pretty, that's, Sabretooth is kind of nice. Um, beast experience, you know, that kind of is what it is. Uh, and then we have the king himself. <sighs> Armor. Of course he's armor. Figured he'd be armor. <laughs> I'm not at all surprised that he's armored. Um, colorless is interesting. Kind of, kind of thought he'd be red, but that's okay. I'm not gonna complain. Uh, so we got Lion King Fang grants attack plus three if foe initiates combat. Grants attack speed, defense, res plus four during combat. Uh, at start of turn, blah blah blah. If unit transform grants attack plus two. Unit cannot counter attack, or unit can counter attack regardless of foe's range. So we have distant counter on this guy. Oh, oh, Kangas is. Uh, ooh, ooh. We have distant defense four, so we have a new premium four tier skill here. Distant defense four, which works nicely with his weapon. I'll give him that. Um, defense res plus eight, man. Wow. He's got Vengeful Fighter and Distant Guard. <whistles> Dang. My boy. I don't know, fam. This is, oh, man. This is rough, dude. This is rough. This is rough. I'm pretty hyped. Uh, I know that, well, I don't know, but I have a feeling that maybe this banner might get not as much love just because we have had... Uh, some radiant characters already. Um, we had the Val we had Valentine's Path of Radiance too, so that's kind of interesting. Um, man, we've had a lot of radiant love. A lot of Tellius. interesting, huh? Huh. <laughs> not really, not really sure how to feel about that. Um, I don't want to make this video too long. I'm gonna get to bed. <laughs> 
I'm having a lot of thoughts and feelings. I might I might do some kind of follow up. I'm just excited. <laughs> but let me know what your thoughts are in the comments down below or to the side or wherever they be. Um, subscribe to the channel if you haven't, if you want to. We do lots of Fire Emblem Heroes over here. Some other Nintendo stuff as well. I don't know, man. I'm pretty excited. All right. I'm, uh, I'm going to dip out. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I will catch you next time.